amazing. I mean, uh, I can't, you know, I, I, I'm, I still don't believe it, but here we are. Well, John Slattery, you know, I mean, he asked me to do it, and I, I couldn't believe that he asked me, and I would do anything for him, and, and um, so that was it. The script is something I couldn't stop thinking about. I would talk about it all the time, but I couldn't do it for a while. And, and I really, I approached him, and I was like, listen, it's not that I don't want to do it. I just don't know when I can. I don't, I don't want, and he kind of just looked at me, and he's just, well, I'm not going to do it unless you do it. He was kind of straight up. And I knew he meant it. <laughs> I knew he was just like, I'm just, there's no point. This character of this uh, really struggling woman who, you know, who's grieving the loss of her son and, and not communicating with her husband and, and, and feeling so desperately alone in this time and, and looking for answers and, and taking desperate measures. And as, a, uh, as an actress, that's like all the stuff you want to dive into and, and um, so much happening at once. So it was, it was incredibly intriguing. Well, to make a film, you got to kind of, you see both the good and the bad of everybody. You know, you kind of, you kind of got to be who you are, you know, and you got to let people be who they are. And you get, you get, you get intimate, you know, you learn about people. You, you think, well, I've, I've got this great script and these great actors, Hopefully, it'll all work out. You know, it's a period film, and there's it's not a lot of money, and there are a lot of people in it, a lot of locations, and um, that's difficult to pull off. Everyone in it was just so phenomenal, and and certainly, um, like, really um, makes you want to do the best you can do. You're not gonna not know your lines when Philip Seymour happens across from you. <laughs>